Why why did I just need to do that? Why, why couldn't I just be smart once in my life? Why couldn't I not do things in because I'm a man, baby? How's it going, boys? The new expansion is here, new cards, and we are playing standard yet again. So I saw this card. Puppet Stitcher, not Puppet Stitcher, but Puppet Stitcher, because it is an indie development company at the end of the day. And I wanted to make a zombie deck. So I made a zombie deck, and it was cute, and if you want to see the zombie deck, just comment below. I will uh, I will make a video with the pure zombie deck. But then I started to get into the idea of the Puppet Factory. At the beginning of your upkeep, if you control three or more creature tokens, you may can transform Puppet Stitcher. And the factory is an artifact, and every token you control loses all abilities and has base power of 3-3. Three, three. Which means if we combine this with pests, honestly, it's far better than the zombies with decay. The decay, honestly, is pretty hard to deal with. You want to be aggressive, but if you fail at the aggression, you're kind of going to lose most of the time. So, this artifact is amazing. That's the only reason we have blue in this deck, is because of this. So, yeah. Loath spiderlings become 3-3s and every pest becomes a 3-3. Admittedly, they no longer give us life, which is a small problem and you need to be careful to not kill yourself by accident. But, you know, things happen as they say. Then we have this thing, Novice Occultist. 1, 10 out of 10 bay, not gonna lie. 2, dies, draw a card. And when we have this many things, for example, Malachi's Reaper that uh, synergizes really well with that, we have Rotten Reunion, which is by far one of the most amazing cards this new, uh, this new, uh, this new expansion has. One, a uh, one man, two, two. Two man, cast from the graveyard, two, two. It is pretty unanimously great. We obviously have village rights, in Infernal Grasp, this is a little bit like a meme I put inside this deck. I would not say this is the best card. You can probably do better. And honestly, the pay to life is a little bit devastating. But I do really enjoy the art. So, you know, if you want this deck a little bit better, replace it with some other removal. Uh, Plum the Forbidden, obviously, because we do have pests. We will have a lot of pests. A Night Witch, as always. And a Shambling Ghast for a little bit of ramp. A very strong deck because it, do, it, it does have pests and these pests are, well, now these pests are extremely dangerous. A 2-2 two, two is two times better than a 1-1, one, one, but a 3-3 three, three is a million times better than a 1-1, one, one. so you know, you remember that. And not to mention getting three to uh, tokens to uh, flip this dude is <laughs> ridiculously easy. If you thought pest decks were strong before because of just Silver Moorwich, well... Now a whole new world of possibilities has entered the scene, boys. And, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. 21 lands to be specific. 2.0 average. A lot of 1-drops, as you can see. A lot of 2-drops. And a little bit. You know, it's a decent mana curve, to say the least. And with that being said... Please like the video if you're here, why not? It's the best thing you can do and help out me with the channel, so thank you if you do that. Subscribe, there's a Patreon link down below for people who want to support me directly. And, speaking about Patreons, we have a new Patreon, boys. Joshua Stevenson. A very British name, my dude. I enjoy it, it's a good name. Thank you for your support, I greatly appreciate that. Just find me in the Discord, PM me in the Patreon so I can give you a role in the Discord, and it's gonna be amazing. Also, link for the Discord down below. It's free for everyone, but there's only 0.257 slots available, so you better act quick to get in. And with that being said, without any further ado, boys, let's get a cracking and see what happens now, shall we? Is this okay, by the way, to call it a Dimmer deck? It's not technically... Well, it is technically a Dimmer deck, but, you know. We have a one blue card. Thank you very much. Uh, Poker God. But we have a Night Witch and two ghost, Ghosty Boys. So, this is technically not that bad. A fast Lolt, but the enemy does go first. Well, we're just gonna have to see what it is. Wizard class. I am, by the way, uh... I should have probably not done that. <laughs> yeah. 
Man, I forgot this is the other way around. That's the problem with me in new lands, but this land does have really good art, so 10 out of 10. Ooh, look at that. So, what are you? Just a basic snow deck? I'm a little bit out of the loop how currently standard works. I did not play standard before uh, the release now. So, you know, a little bit out of the loop how things are supposed to work and what uh, what is to be expected and so on. Uh, but I would not say that that's a bad thing. Well, technically it is a bad thing. Uh, but you get the point. It, it's not the end of the world. It's not completely detrimental and so on and so on. Ooh, that's a counterspell, I think. Most likely a counter spell. Okay. Ooh, yes, sir. That's that. That's that's the stuff I like. Not good attack. Now he needs to pay the two life wad, which is annoying. Currently, not that bad. I'm thinking about probably gonna keep that Malachi's Rebirth in hand to protect Seldomor. No, maybe this is a pure blue deck. I honestly can't tell. Again, a little bit of a small problem is that I have not played Standard for a very long time now, now, so, you know, new expansion and stuff. A lot of things I see are gonna be, like, a little bit iffy-jiffy. Huh. Drop this. Well, I will attack, that's for sure. Okay, so, attack. I will be able to just Malak- Oh, yes, he blocks. Good. Good, that's actually one of the things I wanted to see. Okay, so... I can do this in multiple ways. First one is, well, obviously this. I'm gonna go for the blue land, by the way. We don't have a lot of them, so yeah. I'm gonna go for the Lolt Spider Mommy play really early on. He has four months, so chances are he will do something that will waste his mana. This is a counter spell 100%. So, you know. I could also just play it so he thinks I don't have threats, but it is... Oh! Yes! That's good. If he doesn't draw a land, we pretty much win, because that is a winner chicken dinner play right there, boys. And we win. Mostly because he did not have a land. But drawing enough lands is a skill. Which, you know, you should probably use. Okay, so how am I gonna do this? Do I want to attack with the Eye Twitch? I probably do want to attack with the Eye Twitch. I will have another Eye Twitch, so, you know, it's fine. These things have reach, so absolutely no worries in the neighborhood. And now... What is he gonna do now? Oh! No one cares! The horror! Ah, uh, get it. Okay, currently it's good. Oh, that was Behold Thine Multiverse! Interesting. You always expected to saw it coming. Well, I guess not in this reality. Ooh! Ooh, someone try- uh, so Someone does not like Spider Mommy. Or you just wanna- You made a third- Oh! Oh! Right. I forgot. You know, I'm not gonna exactly complain too much about that, honestly. And now I'm gonna finally do this. I really want to do this because I honestly don't want to deal with the spirit doing stuff, so there we kind of go. Uh, Grasp. Is Grasp useful? Probably not. Okay, I do want to draw a Plum the Forbidden. If I draw a Plum the Forbidden, it's gonna be as easy as... I don't honestly have anything for this, but I'm gonna drop everything. It's a blue deck. It's like, I lose nothing by dropping everything. And I can pretty much attack with also everything. Do I attack with the pest? Nah, I'm not gonna attack with the pest. This guy is so done, by the way. I have no idea what was his game plan. Even though Mono Blue, I think, can technically work nowadays, because it doesn't seem that bad. The game's a little bit slow. Hopefully, Wizards is done with their shenanigans of making... Oh! Oh my! Uh, create 4-4. Four, four. You may choose a player to turn a creature they control to its owner's hand. Which is a little bit annoying, but at the same time... Well, oh no, the shambling geist returns. Such horror. Do I want to kill that thing? I, I think I do. I... I 
I can't imagine honestly him playing anything that I cared about, you know? So I might as well do it like that. I can literally attack. Yeah, well, as expected. Nice. Well, let's go again. What else can I say? It's gonna be great. Pablo. Pablo Picasso. Yeah, I hate it when they just give me one land to st Wizards! I excuse me, but do you, do you even understand what you're currently doing? I do get to go first, but that does not make me feel okay. Okay, um, so, the thing is, usually when you do the second mulligan, you never brick, but currently we bricked like there is app. Oh, wait. Professional gamer. Yeah. Bet you didn't saw that coming. Okay, give me a land. Uh, let's... Well, honestly, fumigation will probably be really good here. But I'm gonna take environmental science because I am a tool. Okay, that's not bad. And now, let's just get rid of the eye twitch. Okay, I'm not gonna attack with these, but there's, uh, there's absolutely no downside to just prepping with them. So, you know. I wonder what this guy is gonna do. I don't know what life gain decks exactly are capable of currently. I know that they're not devastating or anything like that, but you know, it's like, j j just questionable. Again, not gonna attack. There's no reason to attack. This 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 can decay and proc loot, so that's the cool part. And by the way, also a good reason to. Okay, there, chief. Relax. So uh, relax. How about how about them potatoes, potatoes? Uh, go for the blue. I like that I have two blue. Two blue seems like uh, the optimal uh, play. So yeah. Life gain decks are obviously gonna be still extremely overpowered, but the good part is, yeah, we can deal with them. The only thing that life de uh, decks, ooh, that's a load spider mommy right there, boys. Yum yum. And the only real good thing that, do I want to attack with this? I think I do. The only really, really good thing that uh, life gain decks now have is a new one cost soul cleric, which is extremely good. And two, it is a four cost enchantment that draws you cards, aka extremely powerful and potent stuff right there. I do have a lot of plum the forbiddens. I do have this, so I can do I, I can do some stuff. I'm I'm kind of trying to get the emblem currently. If it's a life gain deck or if it's a cleric deck, which it could potentially be with a pyre. Okay, there. I, return to the I hate you, Pablo. I really do. Uh, plan B. Uh, definitely plan B. Sacrifice, five. Yeah, that's that seems like a worthwhile sac uh, sacrilege. Yeah, let's, let's just do this. This is gonna be pretty spicy. God, the uh, the ca the uh, the life loss though, that's a problem. <laughs> the life loss is a serious problem. But we should be fine if we get enough stuff. Okay, we got a new lult, which is, you know, always good. Drop this and what what do I want to go for? I want to go for this and a shambly boy. Shambly boy plus that is good. A lot spider mommy. We have a seldom or witch. The question is, what is he gonna do now? Like, vanishing verse. Oh, we could have been in such good positions. But, you know, it didn't happen. Because if someone hates lot spider mommy for some reason. You're disgusting. Okay, that's also a problem. Uh. Well, wait a minute. I don't think that was the play. I'm kind of against using necrotic fumes most of the time as a card. But, you know, this time it, it seems extremely good. It seems extremely decent. Hmm. Wait, maybe I want to do it differently? Uh... <clears throat> Hmm, man. I want to do a setup. That's like the thing. 
You know... No, I can't... Okay, let's do it like this. Uh, the thing is, I can't really risk it too much. So that's something I don't like. I can't risk it. Uh, as the, a target creature or planeswalker, here we go. I don't want to risk it at this point. That, that cleric, for a moment there I thought I uh, screwed that one up, by the way. So, you know, that's the pause. I don't want to risk that cleric doing bad stuff to us, okay? So that's that's the main thing here. Also, I can technically play Lolt, plumb the forbidden, get the stuff done, and that would be great. Ah, uh, yeah, that's something I was a little bit cheeky about, but I don't think he has much uh, much else there. Also, again, it's like, well, what are you gonna do? Here we have the pyre, but the pyre is kind of like meh at this point, honestly. So, do this. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna just go for this and get rid- wait, wait, oh, I exiled it, right. Maybe I don't get rid of- no, no, I do, I do. Wait, should have probably waited. Uh, patiently, long have we waited, but, you know, at the end, we are just baited. Gonna play this as a land. We have, we have a... <gasps> no! Oh, right, right, right. DK still pops. Oh, I'm scaring myself so much here, boys, because of unfamiliarity with the mechanics still. <laughs> oh, that could have been horrible. Are you kidding me? Is that even a card? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What? Look at this. Look at me, Jorge. This is a card. Man, I am damaging myself so much, it's honestly a little bit scary. Ah, he surrenders before the lolt. That's a pretty nice loading screen. It's tame, it has nothing inside it, but for wizards, I think that's nice production. I stitch snowy stuff. This guy, Plum the Forbidden. I'll honestly take it. Keep. I don't go first. Well, that's a problem. Man, please, wizard, just allow me to go first every every single game. Is that too much to ask, honestly? Is it? Is it too much to... I don't think it is. I don't... I, I think it's a tame request, considering my personality. Is this gonna... Ah, uh, it's one of... It's a Shambly boy deck. Yeah, it's a Shambly boy deck. Well, now, everyone loves the Shambly boy decks. Not much I can do about that. But at least I will be able to play this. So, I can win sh against Chambly Boys with Lult Spider Mommy. It it's even pretty easy to a technical degree. And we do have a lot of stuff, so... It's not the worst, but he gets to go first, which kind of does make it extremely bad. <laughs> it does make it extremely bad. I think I will... S uh, and it's instantaneously dead, huh? Wow, aren't you a champion of the people? Come on! Come on! Block? No blocks yet? Damn it. If you drop a fourth land... Oh, you didn't. That's amazing. Low skill. Oh, huh. Well, I don't have too many choices, but this is not as bad as one may, may expect. So, the thing is, I kind of think... I will plumb the forbidden here, as strange as that may honestly seem. <laughs> because of one simple reason. Because of one simple reason I will plumb the forbidden here. You see... The thing is, I think he is missing one land off of playing what's it called. So, you know. I, I need to get my stuff out first, and then we can actually achieve something. And this is honestly good enough. I could... No, I'm not gonna play it. I'm not gonna play it. I'm not gonna be greedy Stevie about it. Okay, now he can cast the stupid thing. Ah, uh, skeleton swarming. Wizards, come on. Why can't I get skeleton swarming any time in my life? Why, why does my opponent get skeleton swarming? I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of hugely disappointed, not gonna lie. Create two black spiderlings, blah, blah, blah. Let's see, what do I want to go with here? I think I'm going to play the Shambly Boy. Yeah, I'm definitely playing the Shambly Boy. So there are going to be a lot of problems with this. 
Oh, he blocks. I, I, well, I guess it's time, huh? So, what do I have here that does stuff? Hmm, no, no, no. Yeah, exactly as I anticipated. <laughs> I don't have, I don't have anything. Yep, that, that's exactly as I anticipated it. I don't have anything that, that removes enchantments. And another one! Because, you know, fuck bitches get money, obviously. Uh, uh, absolutely, obviously. Did it, did it, how, how could it be anything else at this point? Well, whatever. Honestly, we only have one play in the studio, and that's called whatever the hell was that. So... Wait, I just attack with everything and call it a day? Am I gonna win because of that player? Does he have something that ruins it? Oh! The, the carriage! Call! That's the only thing that creates enough blockers, I think. That is the only thing that creates enough blockers at that point. <sighs> Come on, man. Well, I think he's still dead, though. I'm just gonna get rid of one cat and those things are tapped. That's what people don't realize about uh, about these things. They do come tapped, and that's that's like my biggest problem with uh, skeleton swarming. It's a really good card, but at the end of the day, well, they are tapped and they are forced to attack. I'm sorry. Did that make the situation better in any? <laughs> Okay, dude. Okay. Okay. It has menace. You can't even block it like that. Someone reads cards less than me. That's amazing. What a time to be alive, boys. As always, new expansion hits. And, well, they're slaying it. What else can I say? The deck's good. Go first, two lands, two grasps of spider mommy, village rights, and a shambly boy. Is this not love? Is this what love feels like? Because I think it is. And I'm, I am, I, I, I am not ashamed to admit it. Cat on purple is also love. Are you telling me that's just another one of those? Uh, yeah, go for this. Why not? It's not like he's gonna counterspell anything. So I'm gonna go for a fast lull plate. Uh, lull plate uh, yet again. Wait. Which one is better to sack? Well, I, I guess the eye twitch, because we're thinning out the deck extra with this, right? I'm honestly not sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm honestly not 100% uh, sure. Three infernal grasps. Now that's... Now that's quality. Ooh. Okay. Now it's time to play it like this. Okay, do it like that, and let's take the second bluey boy land, right? Do this, and let's get a, get rid of the environmental science. Again, no real reason to summon it, but hey, at least it's something technically threatful. So yeah, not, not that bad. I think I'm gonna have to use this. Crush the weak, you say? Ouch. Well, it could have been worse. So, it's a Giant's deck, huh? Yeah, it must be a Giant's deck at this point. Get rid of Crush the Weak. I think he could play things, right? I, I, I don't... I don't remember how Giants work, okay? It's a completely fine thing. Oh god, we got punished for... Wait, how much of a poker god am I currently? Two, two of these, two of these, three of these, two of these, one iPad and one Lult. Pretty good poker god, yeah. Pretty good. I amaze myself at my skill at being a p -p 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 poker god sometimes. What is he? It must be a giant deck, right? No one else would ever use this in their minds. Because it looks like a giant card, you know? <laughs> it is a valid, by the way, thing to, to say. Okay, do this and a lult. Spider Mommy, let's go! 
with this deck idea, by the way, I am I am a little bit uh, think I I do think a little bit that maybe it is fine to sometimes play Lolt and not instantaneously go for the minus three. It, it is aggro, but getting her emblem just insta wins, you know. And now it's open to yeah, it's open to stupid stuff like prismatic command. So no, it's not a giant deck. I am so confused what this garbage actually is. Hello there. <laughs> okay. I like this. I like this. Not gonna lie. Now I'm gonna draw cards though. Uh, that's that's not bad. It, it does give me something. Let's see. Six. Yeah, let's drop this. It's a little bit better. It, it's I have more I have more synergy with instants and whatnot, so yeah. Also, he can't he can't just ignore uh you, you know, he can't just flat out only attack Lolt and stuff. He he needs to deal with this board. That's gonna be five damage, then he's on nine HP. And nothing he drops is gonna survive because Infernal Grasp. Also, Infernal Grasp scales really good. Uh, with that three cost black book. I'm not using it, but I could theoretically use it book of bad deeds I think it's called or something stupid like that Okay, hello there Well, if you're gonna do that, I'm gonna do this. I Am gonna go absolutely 100% all out on you my dude If you are legitimately planning something like this Okay, let's hope he does... Wait, how much is that? Ah, it doesn't matter. I'm still gonna do this, obviously. So, you're telling me that guy's just a mill deck or something, by the way. That, that, that's what I'm currently gathering. Uh-huh. Double strike? No! Are you kidding me? Are you, are you, are you... Are, uh, did, did, did. Really? Really? Is this how it ends? Is this how it ends? Amazing. What will we meet this time? Is it gonna be a creature deck? Probably a creature deck. I don't think anyone even plays anything but creatures in uh, standard. Oh, look at this. Nice. We never start with that dude. Oh, and a seldom witch. Woof. Woof. Wow. Blue King RS. This is not. Don't escape, my dude. What are you exactly doing here? Tell me your secrets. Well, a night witch start is pretty good. Oh, look at that. It's Blizzard Brawl because reasons. Because, of course, it is. Drop the night witch. If I drop th this doubled, oh god, it's gonna be so good. But he's gonna blizzard brawl me, I can guarantee you. This absolute loser is gonna blizzard brawl me, I can guarantee you that. Uh, it's always blizzard brawl. So what do I want to lose? Honestly, at this point, probably the witch. Yeah, the witch is probably the thing I want to lose, uh, lose the most. But if I survive... There's uh, Infernal Grasp, there's a Plunder for... There, there's... There. Okay, so, if I survive this, it's not gonna be only glorious, it's it's gonna be unanimously glorious. And Blizzard Brawl, he's already... Wizards, just, just, just stop it. Every green deck does not require a br Blizzard Brawl in the opening hand. It, it, no, no, the, 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 there's no, there's no need to do that, okay? There is absolutely, I, I guess I blocked the wolf anyway, it, it doesn't really matter too much, but. Oh, like, god damn it, wizards. Okay, take the pest thing. Ooh, that's pretty, that, that's, that's pretty good, right? That, that is definitely pretty good. I'm uh, gonna go for the black here, and gonna go for this bad boy. Every if if he has another br blizzard brawl, he he obviously has another blizzard brawl, right? Please don't blizzard brawl me again. Ah, oh, why does this need to happen in standard? I I don't understand this. 
Like, for a forced opening he Oh, by the way, so... There is this thing that people say, uh, that people say, I think Wizards has stated or, or something like that, that when the game starts, the system draws two hands, and it gives you the best hand out of those two hands. So, I hope that's a lie, because if that is true, their RNG system is completely, completely broken. Because think about it in this way. If the game draws you two hands and gives you the best hand, and you have a deck that has 60 cards, and out of those 60 cards you have 8 cards that cost 5 or more, and you have, you know, everything else is a 2 cost or something, and it draws you two hands, and both of those hands, some magic... What is he gonna do here, I wonder? Yonder, I wonder? Oh. So, block this. But imagine, it draws you two hands. You have eight, five costs. Everything else is like one or two costs or three costs. And both of your... Dude, that's so annoying. Well, at least it's a super easy choice. Create a treasure token. Ooh, spider mommy, you say? Well, spider mommy's cute and whatnot. But honestly, at this point, sacrifices must be made. Okay, how will I do this? Do I want to grasp or do I want to do this? Uh, but my... There, there, another... No, he's reading what DK is. Oh, good. But think about it. You draw two hands of seven. You have only eight cards in... Uh, again! Uh, again! Uh, of course it's again. I, I'm, I'm not... I'm not... I'm... Oh, I, I hate this game. Uh, why? It, it's just forced and it's dumb. It's just absolutely forced and it's dumb. The only good part is this. But you know what's the bad part? That this absolute goddamn specimen probably has a third blizzard brawl. Let's be real here for a moment. Last card, probably another blizzard brawl. It is what it is. Hopefully not, because if I get this, it's gonna be fabulous. Oh, another one of those. Well, at least someone... Oh, no, technically, well, a little bit poker god. Just a little bit of a poker god. Anyway, no blocks, obviously, because who would do something as stupid as that? And now, transform. Oh, yeah. That's the stuff. And I even got spider mommy. <laughs> Uh, do I want- no, 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 I want to do this. Oh, look at that, nothing of value. Okay, next turn, next turn. Uh, now I need to be extremely careful because Plum the Forbidden is useless. So, do I summon the- do, do, what, do I summon them? Hmm, we are in this huge stalemate. I lost a little bit too much HP. Ooh, cute, but no cigar as always. Wait. Was that animation always there? Question mark. Well, is he gonna attack? Oh, he does. Oof. Is that really the play? Do Oh, he's gonna put yeah, he's gonna put one counter on each. Oh uh, yeah, that's that that I would say that's probably smart ish ish. If I want to do it like this, well, I still have one left, and I can create another batch. It kind of depends on what he draws next, right? Also, that's very spider mommy. And I can top deck something extremely good, you know, who who knows, uh, essentially. Do I want to transform at this point? Pest, summon two, draw, blah, blah, blah. Actually, yes, transform back, I say. Transform back, I say. And now let's create a bunch of spiderlings and uh, do this uh, shabazzle miracle of a booty. Should probably maybe it no 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 oh no what have I done man I need to hit big here because again oh it's fine whoo oh boys 
Oh, wait, that's bad. Um, wait a minute. Whenever you create it. Oh, this is not Magecraft. I kind of forgot about that. Okay, my dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. Are you kidding me? No. Dude. Dude. No. Oh, god damn it. I forgot. This is so bad. This is. Man, we lost too much HP. We just. It's just. It's just the fact that Wizards rigs the game and puts Blizzard brawls in there. What, what else can I say? What else can I do? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. And now I'm dead. Unless. Unless he doesn't figure it out that this can't block. And he is afraid to block. <laughs> I could have just killed. Another one. Jesus Christ. Man, why, 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 why did I need to be stupid? Why, why did I just need to do that? Why, why couldn't I just be smart once in my life? Why couldn't I not do things in because I'm a man, baby? I ain't got time for your little ridiculous pussy shit of thinking. This is a children's card game at the end of the day. Hey, if you if you're gonna waste time thinking about shits and giggles and whatnot, it's your own damn fault for being a loser. We play it fast, we play it rough, and we do it hard. That's what magic is all about. This was a win. So that's the deck. It's pretty good. Again, r remove the thing that deals damage to your own HP pool in Infernal Grasp. And you're gonna do a little bit a lot better because life is a virtue and you cannot afford to lose that much life in the average. But, no. It is what it is. I had fun. It's decent. We're gonna play standard now for some time now. And, well, can't wait to see what else can we cook up here. This was Quizzer Sinsen. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the channel. Check out the Discord. Check out the Patreon. Check out the everything. And have a nice day. Bye-bye.